and the lights just went out. So luckily, luckily I just got my breakfast done and just got my coffee done. Couldn't be more perfect timing. So now I'm going to put my coffee in my thermos thing so it stays warm because I'm not sure how long the lights will be out because it does this sometimes and it stays out for hours and hours and sometimes it comes back on right away but we lose power often in this house. Okay, this is two smart points, one smart point for the coffee. Having a chili for lunch. Our electricity came back on just recently so we were able to warm lunch up. It is 1.30 right now and I have the tortilla tricolored tortilla strips from Fresh Gourmet. These are really good. You can buy these on Amazon in a huge box of I think a hundred of these and they last forever. We've had them for months now and they are so worth it. In the chili they taste wonderful and a nice crunch in a salad. Anything you not need a nice crunch in. Two points is all that bag is. One point in the Asiago cheese and so this is four smart points. Good morning. I have scrambled eggs and cottage cheese for breakfast today. Again, I am hooked on cottage cheese and scrambled eggs until I move on to my regular breakfast that I had before. This will probably go on all week though. I had my coffee already for one point and this is three points. So guys, if you have a makeup mirror and it's sitting around, be sure to keep it down or away from the sun because look what can happen. It starts on fire like within seconds. Crazy, right? I am still working on my diamond dart. I have it upside down right now because I need my light and my plug-in is so short. So I had to turn this upside down so I could get the light underneath here and see what the heck I'm doing. But this part was really fun to do. It was finally some color in here and the next part is going to be just as fun. And I'm covering up his face. I already cover, covered up the LOL he put on here. So I'll probably do up to there and get rid of all of the the um, the mess he left me here so I could get back to normal. But I don't have long to go. My goal is to get done before September. We'll see how that works out. Breakfast is bacon, egg, and cheese burrito wrap with salsa on top. There it is with the salsa. Good morning guys. We are going to, besides show you my messy house because I haven't cleaned yet this morning, because I worked on, I didn't even do dishes last night, seriously. I worked on my diamond painting. I mean, and that's even a mess. I left my stuff down here and I left a drawer open. I was tired, but it's looking really good. I have it tipped upside down, but these guys want to eat. No, down. You can't jump up on me. Hey, down. You want to eat? You guys want to eat? It gets crazy in here. Crazy pants in here. Come on, guys. Get away from my painting. Eclipse, move. Eclipse, move. Move. There you go. Okay, are you going to sit on your rug, Eclipse? Are you going to sit on your rug? You want to eat? Hmm? What do you do when you want to eat? What do you do? You guys sit down. <laughs> He's like, no, this isn't how it works. You have to go over here and you have to start Luna's food first. I just got done making Corey's breakfast. So I've been getting Luna this now, now, now stuff. She really likes it. She's been on it for quite a while. Um, she's staying pretty regular on her weight, however, um, she did lose like a half a pound, so I don't know what that's about. Um, we are totally out of fruit. Corey got this Relay for Life. We always do the Relay for Life Cancer Walk, and um, they've always got stuff for sale to help out the cancer department. So... Um, yeah, he got this and he, he says it was nice to not have to order a 3X or a 4X. He could order an extra large. <laughs> so that was kind of cool. So while we, while I wait for that to get done and show you my dirty dishes, I always go over here and Eclipse waits patiently on his rug. Are you going to wait patiently on your rug this time? Don't prove me wrong, Eclipse. Don't do it. 
Let me, let me put you on the tripod because I need two hands for this. Hold on. Okay, I think you guys can see him okay. Nope, no. Yes, good boy. Yes. Yeah. We're still working on training. He's supposed to be looking up and not looking at the food. No. Good boy, Clint. Good boy. And then what I do is I'll tip you down and show you. While he's eating, I play with his food. And play with his jaws. And you gotta do this right when he's a puppy because he does, dogs like to try and bite you when you try to grab their food away. So we right away work with him. And if he growls, I quickly grab a snout firmly and tell him no. <laughs> And now he's, even when he eats a bone, anybody can take things away from him, except my other dogs. Then I let him do a little growl so they know that they cannot come and attack his food. See, Luna's getting really close. Usually she can't do that. But because I'm standing here, he's allowing her to do that. If I walked away, he'd growl at her. Good boy, Eclipse. Are you ready to eat? Yeah, she's drooling. <laughs> she's drooling over here. Are you ready to eat? Come on. Come on. Sit. 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 Good boy. Good girl. Uh, uh, no, you gotta wait. Sit. Sit. Miley, sit. Stay. Okay. Ready to eat, Luna? Are you ready? Luna, sit, sit. Good girl, good girl. And I throw the bag in there just so she can lick it out when she's done because um, I don't want to waste any of that after I pay for that. And she has a slow feed bowl as well as Eclipse because, hey, Eclipse, look at that. He had his nose in there eating this stuff. Eclipse, no, you can't have more food. You had two cups already. Piggy, piggy butt. He could eat and eat. Uh, uh, no. No more food, Eclipse. No more food. You want some water? You want water? Yeah? Uh-uh. Good boy. Good boy. So I've got a Diamond Art Club painting from Diamond Art Club. Would you guys like to see an unboxing of this? I could do an unboxing. It's from It's the Beauty. So I could do... Um, I think it's from Mandy Manzano. The artist is Mandy Manzano. So I could do that unboxing. Let me know if you would like to see that. So I was using my, my little markers here from Papermate. I, I do love these markers. And I was filling out my date and stuff for today, which is the 17th. I have eye doctor appointment today that I have to go to, and along with Nick. And Corey says, why don't you ever use your fountain pens? And I said, I don't want to waste the, the ink on them because I love the ink. We bought some new ink and I love this color and I don't want to waste it. And he's like, he goes, honey, I can get you more ink. <laughs> so I'm like, all right then, I'll use my fountain pen. <laughs> so I'm using my fountain pen today. This is a... Lammy fountain pen and I love it. I absolutely love this pen 
and I write my letters in this usually if I hand write a letter and it writes so smooth and so nice and it's been in storage I had to like work on getting it going again <laughs> but if you put it in a little bit of water then it starts working really well and then you just shake it every once in a great while and just write with it it's wonderful it's so smooth and, and nice and it didn't I don't think it went through. No, it didn't even go through or ghost at all. So that's nice. It's nice thick paper though. Really thick paper. I like this paper. And just an FYI, I get this at Michael's and I got the package here. This is what it looks like. It's a Chrissy Ann design. It's on the Chrissy Ann design display. So she has a full display at Michael's and she has lots of lots of stuff. Um, an example would be this washi tape that Eclipse chewed up a little bit. It says it's a planner thing on there. And it's got a lot of different planner things. But my all-time favorite one is... But I had it in my junk here somewhere. Huh. I'm not sure. This is the punch I use to punch this with it was like very cheap on amazon it says smile on it i love that word on things which is why i added it to my mug as well i don't know where that went to what the heck this was also at this was also on a different display at michael's i thought this was really cool because this has little holiday things like there's so many different holidays. Like this is a January holiday thing. And in July, these are all the July holidays throughout the month. So I thought that was cool just to see what holidays are going on. And it's like caviar day and world emoji day and World Wide web day and junk food day, that sort of thing. Coloring book day is August 2nd and then the World Wide Web Day is August 1st so really cool book lovers day is August 9th but every month has one so here is the washi tape that I was talking about you can buy these little hard plastic things and wrap the wrap the washi tape around it because you saw the the roll that I had of that one and I had to buy a few of these because my favorite washi tape is this coffee one I love this coffee one it's so cute and it has like a rose gold foil on it which is really cute and this is also in the Chrissy and design display really cute and then this is her this is her binders and you can buy these there but of course you can't get them personalized there this one I got free on her site because she was having a special when you buy like a certain amount you get one of these for free and so I got that at that time but she has all sorts of stickers like I got these most of these I got at Michael's this this one was just on her website these bunch here I got on her website uh, I think no this was at Michael's too yeah these were all at Michael's these ones I got on her website, so you can tell the difference. They have that on there. And these were just um, plasticky coating kind of feeling. This was a free sticker sheet she threw in there with it. But I love her stickers. They're really cool. And then that's it. Now it does not come with, I put a pocket on here. I got this pocket from um, erincondren.com. So I just stuck that on there. It's just a sheet, a sticky sheet. And I just stuck it on there just for some extra sticker stuff in there. But yeah, I love, and these binders are really sturdy. I mean, really super strong, stronger than any binder I've ever owned. And she's got the 
protector on it on the corner. So I thought, you know, it's worth getting. I, I had enough stickers almost to get it. So I'm like, I'm going to throw one more page in there just so I get the free binder. Because the binder is usually like $19 at Michael's. And it is the perfect size for the sheets. So they fit right in there. So they fit in there perfectly. They're made for this or for her sticker collection. Eclipse was acting really crazy. Eclipse, don't bite at her. That's one thing he's still gotta learn, is not to attack poor Miley. And when he does that, she comes running to me, don't you, Miley? She's like, I know where I'm protected. Yeah. Don't worry, we won't let her let him get after you. I can't wait to get him neutered. Oh my gosh, it can't come soon enough. The end of Jan July, she he will be six months old, and he is getting fixed. He's got an appointment already for July 31st. And I don't know if I'll be able to handle him being gone all night because he's got to stay at the vet's office. Gentle eclipse. Morning time is his crazy wild time. Every morning he does this. Every morning. He's got to run and speed around the house. And it's funny if he has to go poop outside, he runs and runs and runs and runs and runs. And so I know I'm like, okay, he's going to be ringing the bell any second. And sure enough, he rings the bell. Luna. That bone's way too big for you, Luna. Crazy. Once one chews, it seems they all have to find a bone to chew. There's three of them around here. I think Miley took hers downstairs. You are a beautiful dog, Eclipse. You are beautiful. Oh my goodness, I love how beautiful you are. Beautiful dog. I'm so happy with him. We could not have picked a better dog than you, Eclipse. So I wanted to show you guys quick. I know this video is going everywhere, but I bought these dog brushes. Okay, first I started out with this one because we had Max, and this worked pretty good on a boxer. Let's see if I can get... It's the Fur Buster. That worked pretty good on Max, and you can punch that out and then exchange it for a smaller one, like a shorter one. And we got the short one too for cats. So we thought that would be good. This worked pretty good on Max because he has really short fur. But then we had this for Miley and this worked pretty good for Miley. But this one did not work on Eclipse. And I don't even know, this is some generic cheap, cheap, cheap one. Then we learned of the rake. This thing guys, oh my gosh, this is called the rake. This thing is amazing. Furbuster, um, Furminator, none of them even compare to this one. Now there's a, a thinner side and a thicker side. We have to use the thicker side, this side up here for Eclipse. And this works so good. So, so good. And we use this almost every day on him just to, you know, once brush down because he loses so much hair. And it's got a really cushiony handle, like you can squeeze it down. It's actually really cool. So I'm going to take them out and give them a good brushing because, like I said, we usually try and do this a little bit every day just so we can keep up on it. I just tried to show you guys this, but she's going crazy because my got Miley out here too. If I can show you this. Hey, hey. I mean, just one little swipe, and it gets that much fur out of her, him. It's crazy. <laughs> just to walk by. And it's, it's so awesome. I love it. And I just let the fur blow away, and the birds come in and grab it up. It's kind of cute. While I wait for my sink to fill up and get my dishes going, I'm going to show you. I've been trying out some coffee from trade.com trade i think it's trade.com something like that it's the trade company anyways and it's usa usda organic coffee and i've been trying out the irving farm the equator it's a peru and then this is also a peru i've been really enjoying the peru and i had where is it i've got my coffee container thing over here oh this okay so we get condor coffee 
the Peru, and I love, this is one of my favorite ones. So I thought I'd give these Perus a try, and I like both of them. This one is my least favorite so far. It's really light. It's supposed to be a caramel chocolate from Guatemala. Caramel chocolate, black pepper. It's just really light. It's like a light, I don't know if it's a light roast or what it is. I didn't really look, but it was, it was suggested for me from what I put my my thing at. So was this though too. And this one I like. This one wasn't strong enough. This one, these ones are like medium to dark roast, I think. I, I don't know. I tend to like the darker roasts. If you like a lighter roast, this is actually would be good. And then my neighbor brought over this and she asked me if I ever tried the Quick Trip brand coffees and I had not. So we're going to try this one out next week. This is fresh roasted whole bean. I don't know if it's medium or dark roast. It doesn't say. I guess we will find out. You can tell I never reset my timer from when our lights went out yet. <laughs> Good afternoon, guys. I'm working on a video right now, but for my what I ate, I wanted to show you this. I got the iced quad espresso, and then I just add a premier protein in there. Two smart points. Really good drink. And I'm going to get back to my recording. Having some grapes, so actually I have 200 grams, but I ate a few. But I wanted to remind you guys, and I just got done cleaning these. And when I clean my grapes, my little dog goes in her kennel because grapes, probably most of you know, are very toxic to dogs. Any kind of grapes, and even this part of the grape can be toxic to your dog, especially if they're smaller. And it can potentially cause some big damage, if not death, in a dog. So do not let them have grapes. Do not let them have the seeds. If there's any seeds, any part of the grape can be very dangerous to your dog. So don't allow them to have any of it at all and put them away when you're cleaning them or eating them because, yeah, it could be bad. Just an FYI. It is really late to have lunch. It's like almost four o'clock because we were in town late with our eye appointment and all of that. So this is going to be my lunch. I have 160, well, it was 160, but 161. You can have up to 163 for four smart points. That's what I'm having for lunch along with my 100 ounces or 200 ounce, gram, 200 ounces, 200 grams of grapes. So this is four smart points for lunch. I am having some chili with some Asiago cheese and a packet of the tortilla strips tricolor. 